Today I have a brand new 6'8 build for y'all. I know, no surprise there, damn near all my builds are 6'8. But this build truly is a so fun to play with a true point guard, 95 pass accuracy. I got the 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 96 midi. Just just a crazy ass point guard build with strength too, not to mention gold clamps. Like yeah, man. So I got the gameplay for y'all, and then of course I'm gonna show y'all how to make the build first though. So first I'm gonna show y'all how to make the build in the builder, what I did, and then I'm gonna show y'all gameplay of this build, man. Let's get to it. All right, man. So you're gonna want to go point guard, six eight, two fifteen on the weight, and a six foot eight wingspan. Now that is a very short wingspan, but y'all gotta remember, man. I have a ninety six mid range, so like that's the shortest I can really go, honestly, for that high of a mid range. Now, one thing I learned about two K this year, especially when it comes to finishing, bro, ninety one is that is is that level where like that's where you become an elite finisher, like. On my other six eights, I have like an 84, you know, 87, but no, 91, this is where you become an elite finisher. Like, I'm not going to lie. You get damn near every finishing badge on Hall of Fame besides B Bunny, but I mean, that's not that big of a deal. F F Fearless finisher, gold, really good. Sl now, Slithery gold and Slithery Hall of Fame, huge difference, but you'll be fine with all these ha Hall of Fame badges when it comes to finishing, so layups like the layup packages you get are insane the florida packages are just crazy so when it comes to finishing yes for sure go with the 91 that's why i went with the 91 now 96 this once again there's a huge difference between 92 and a 96 mid range because i usually go with a 92 mid range on my point guard builds that have a night a, a pretty high mid range but 96 man you get hall of fame space creator hall of fame green machine hall of fame guard up Hall of Fame open looks like you you get so many just really good Hall of Fame badges when it comes to that 96 mid range and then of course 86 three point shot for the 85 limitless silver agent three um bronze limitless range like y'all saw what I was doing in that intro like come on now like 86 three insane 96 mid range just like you you you're a bucket then of course 95 pass accuracy man gold bailout Hall of Fame break break starter dimer gold pretty much every playmaking badge besides post playmaker on gold or higher this is an elite playmaker like 100 this is the tyrese Halliburns. burns this is the 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 just 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 really elite playmakers um ball handle you're only six eight so this is as high as it can go 85 which honestly the six you get at 85 you don't need nothing else better like honestly like you can get the job done you you, you can create your own space with an 85 ball handle speed with ball not too crazy now 93 primer defense you, you you get gold clips so you're pretty much an elite defender as well and then of course the speed 81 for silver um speed boost you see is bronze and silver excel you also need that strength 84 i was really gonna go 92 but i'm gonna be honest i really wanted that 96 mid range with the 91 driving layup so 84 strength still pretty good because you, you you still bulldoze people out out the way pre pretty easily so the strength 84 you'll be just just find out some mission physical handles and move on the and silver just really crazy and then of course stamina 99 this is going to be called a two-way diamond three level threat man this build is so well versatile bro i really hope y'all enjoyed this build man this build is going to be crazy and yeah man let's get to some gameplay all right man now to the gameplay because what is a build video with, without ga gameplay man what like what is that so i'm on the drive in the paint bail bail, bail out pass to, to a small four easy bucket this build gets a 95 pass accuracy with the gold bail out and that's the main reason why i like bail so much because if, if if i go up with some bullshit shit man i can just bail bail myself out easy pass now that right there was a shot I, but i'm still getting used to, to, to the contested system when it comes to builds with high mid, mid ranges because a lot of shit be open that you don't be thinking is open now easy floater right here by far my favorite 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 thing to, to do on th this build shoot floors man this build gets a hall of fame flow game the floors are just too uh, just too fucking nice now one thing i will suggest for 2k25 we need flo floater styles bro but like because one thing i learned the floaters are like they they're, they're 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 like mesh with the layup styles and i think we need floor styles man because the mitch be going crazy now behind behind the back speed boost to the right wing easy three I, hey i'll be going crazy with, with the sharp tech man i'll be going crazy this build is just so fun to play on another lay oh my god acrobatic finish that that is nasty that hall of fame acrobat is crazy nowhere near as good as it was last year but it still gets the job done for sure 
hit, hit that AI in the corner because his man is pinching. I don't know why pe people keep leaving bots open in 2024. I don't get it. Now, right here, this is an open shot, bro. And I'm going to end the half with this beautiful shot rising up over my, my defender. Easy bucket. Yes, that's open. That, that That's wide open. And that is the beauty of a, a su such a high mid-range rating, man. I have a 96 mi midi, so a lot of shit that might not be open for, for let's say, like an 84 is open for a 90, 90, 96. Now, when I'm on this build, I'm always in a score first men mentality, but this game especially, I was just in a make the right play mentality for sure. So, double screen right there, I usually hate du double screens, but right there, they actually worked. And the only reason I hate double screens is because for, for mo the most most part, they, they should be in the way. Like, y'all aren't even set setting me a screen, like, y'all are just in the way. Now, this dickhead right here, I, I don't know what he was doing all game. He was pissing me off, like, the entire game. I'm like, can I get get the ball? He finally passed me me, me the ball. Dreadhead, late close out, easy buck, man. So, we're only down six foot with about two minutes left. In, in the fourth i passed to the paint like what does that take like and then he gonna flop i hate when niggas flop after they fuck up like nah nigga you the one who fu fucked up bro like come on now now i was trying to get a hop step step there but i'm like i see my, my boy cut him. that's my four was nice by the way man shout out to him he was the only one on my team that had a brain like dead ass the only nigga on my team with with a brain i got take right here easy floater man i was gonna go with the scoop but i'm like nah man i feel like taking the floater so it's it's just so tough man the flo flo the floater literally can give you another another eight to ten points i swear to god because people always play back when you drive so that's the easy bucket every time want to be K kd right right here he he think he doing shit man just look at the defense bro just look at the defense he passed it back to him nah nigga you ain't going nowhere that's a brick wall boy oh my god the gold clamps on this build is just insane, bro. There's a huge difference between gold clamps and silver clamps. Not to mention a immovable move, enforcer because this build does have an 84 strength. So that definitely makes a difference as as, as well. And that, yeah, man, we just hoop, just hoop, hoop man. You, you see the inbounder pass it, just give and go. That's a, actually a, re, a really nice cut by him. He, he 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 was cutting all games. So I'm like, I should just reward him. Now, right here, he fucked me up, man. He fucked my ass up, man. That's a, that's a good crap, man. That's a really good crap. I can't even get mad at that. That yeah, I can't even get mad at that. When he when he did that, I was like, damn, like he just fucked my ass up. But you see right here, man. All right, man, it's starting to get into crunch, my man. Let 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 me lock lock, lock the fuck in down to, down two. I, I let him jump because that's that's what they all want to do. Now I, I'm gonna be honest. I think I sold this game, man. I'm not gonna lie. Y'all y'all gonna see how in a minute for, for sure. I don't know why I always get stuck with the teammates that leave their man open when they know they can, can shoot. For some reason, big man's playing play pay. Like, what are you doing? Who are you guarding? Like, why is he wide open? Come on, bro. Like, that is just bad defensive IQ, bro. Now, this right here is when I say I think I sold. Please look at this, y'all. I'm not going to lie, bro. This right here is a shot, bro. And I got to take... I don't know what I was, I think I, I was just rushing, man. I was thinking too much, but instead I go to a hand in my face. Like, that's just a bad shot. Definitely so sold that game. We end up losing, man. So that, I will take the blame for that. I will take the blame for that because that definitely is a not the best shot to take. Especially when I got take, man. Like, I'm wide open, just, just shoot the ball. But, hey, man, I think I, I was just o o overthinking too much. But, anyways, on to this next next game, man. Easy pat, easy dump, dump inside. Now, I... Man, I, man, I, I made, made about six threes this game, man. I was going crazy for, from three. I ain't going to lie. But you see, we, we started off th this game with, with just great defense, just immaculate de defense. Now, this game was actually pretty easily won. Um... My teammates play great defense, man. They knew how to cut. Now, on this break, you should always keep the the defender guessing, man. He, I was faking like I was going to the rim, and then I just went out for an easy three. He literally just let me me shoot. Once again, one, two, easy euro. Oh my god, James Harden layup style for six eight guards. Oh my god, it's so it's so tough, man. I would highly recommend his lay, layup style. He giving me the bomb, getting right to my spot. Nine, 96 mini man, just take the mini man, just take what is not broken man if, if it ain't broke don't fix it man it's just that simple now behind the back into the three front from the hash that's tough that that is too nasty but no man i'm not done man i think this is right here is when i took this deep ass three walked it up just just easy man walk up with take that's a bucket man like that is oh my god sharp take with with with, with an 86 three it's, it's just it's literally broken bro like you make you make every deep three you take once again man it's easy screen to, to, to the corner i have no idea why my teammate went corner that's just bad space in my hand but it is what it is man and then another catch and shoot three man i made about about between five and six threes this game like i was going crazy this, this game and, and we ended up winning this game man so that's the bill for y'all man hopefully y'all boys enjoyed i will be dropping more content soon obviously 
Um, I'm actually really excited for 2K25, man. Really excited. I, I can't wait to see the, the things that they change. I know it's like a trend now to just hate on 2K, which it, it, it is a fair point to make. But I'm excited for 2K25, man. So I will see y'all boys in the, in the next video, man. I'm out. Peace.